With Asgard and Vanaheim both ravaged, the two sides could only now consider what was once unthinkable. Compromise. So Mimir, a particularly brilliant negotiator, was selected as the sole arbiter between the two sides. And he brokered an interesting solution. Freya, Freyr's sister, and the other leader of the Vanir would marry Odin, king of the Aesir. Struck by Freya's beauty, Odin readily agreed. But Freya spat at the thought. Odin had tried to destroy her home, her family, and everything she loved, and, oh yes, attempted to murder her beloved brother. Still, she couldn't let the chance for peace among the realms pass by. Though she barely managed a smile through the entire ceremony, the Aesir Vanir wedding was cause for enormous celebration. As Odin took in his beautiful new wife, draped in the finest fabric and Vanir jewels, his kingdom felt nearly complete. As for Freya, well, with the promise of peace resting behind his curled smile, Odin didn't seem too terrible. The raucous party continued well into the night, with the sounds of celebration carrying throughout the kingdom. Yet the peace this union provided carried much further, rippling from Asgard to Jotunheim, Muspelheim, and every place in between. Pre-order and get three shield skins for end game. PlayStation.